hello welcome back to the vlogs today I wanted to vlog because I'm hanging out with little burkers today um, I'm just getting ready I straightened my hair and then put okay this one's looking a little funky but I wanted to put some of my layers in rollers so that way I have a little bit of volume um, I want to do my makeup but I don't think I want to wear foundation because it is hotter than a popcorn fart so we are not going to be doing foundation Maybe a little concealer though. So, oh, I hear the ZZ, the ZZ Weezy. Hi, mommy, come here. You want to go up? I keep come up. Up, 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 up. Oh, why is your diaper halfway off your butt? Oh my gosh, why is your diaper hanging off? So I do have a Zoe update on why Miss Thing has to stay in diapers. So Zoe has to be in diapers now because she has been leaking nonstop and it's it's been really frustrating. It's not a UTI, thank God, but Johnny and I think she's just getting to an age where she can't even hold in her bladder for even a little bit. Like, is there such thing as being like extra incontinent? Because she was already incontinent. Now she's like extra incontinent. <laughs> like she can't, like as soon as she drinks water, comes out. Like, and not a full, like when I normally express her, I fill up a whole pee pee pad. Not like big amounts like that, but it's just like constantly just kind of leaking. And this is already her third diaper of the day, and it's only lunchtime. We've had to kind of change our routine a little bit, and I had to order more diapers for her because she just has to be in diapers constantly. Because every time I take them off, I'm like, okay, I just expressed her. She's going to be fine. Literally 10 minutes later, there'll be a little bit of pee somewhere, either on the carpet, on her bed, on the floor, wherever. It's just... Ugh. And I honestly cannot stand pee. I'd rather her have a poop accident than a pee accident because I don't know why pee grosses me out more than poo. Is that weird? Like, and I also think poo is easier to clean than pee. Like, pee just goes everywhere and sometimes you may not even see it all. Like, you could miss a spot, but like, poo is very easy. Like, you can see it right there. You can see it, you can smell it. Pee is like, is a little sneaky and I just don't like it. Anywho, what am I doing? I am gonna do some brows and I'm gonna do my eyes and some blush and I think that's it. I wanna play around with eyeshadows a little bit more just to like, just to get back into the groove and the feeling of wearing eyeshadow, doing my makeup, that sort of thing so that way when I'm doing all of these practice runs for my wedding makeup, I'm a little more confident and it doesn't feel so bizarre wearing makeup. So I think I want to do like eyeliner, mascara, eyeshadow today. So we'll play around with that. Ta-da! Here is today's makeup look. Let's take out these rollers and see what we're working with. Here is the final look for today. I like... I like this little swoop. I know I recently did a video on my main channel sharing how I added layers into my hair and I really like how it turned out but I think I want them a little bit shorter so I might go back in and retrim all of my layers but I don't know. I like this. I like this. I should do that more often with the little roller. Okay, today's makeup look. Now I'm just waiting for Burkers to get here and yeah. I'm with Bookers and she's ordering Starbies for us. Um, I'm getting a little bit of a coffee headache. I've been trying not to rely on coffee as much so I don't have it daily. I would say maybe every other day now but I'm feeling a coffee headache. Okay anywho we're gonna go thrifting which I'm very excited for and yeah let's see what we find. Hopefully some good stuff. Here is the drink I got. Um, Grande Hazelnut Oat shaken espresso blonde espresso i don't know 
Brooker's ordered it. What'd you get? A chai with almond milk. Ooh. Okay, let's see if it's good. I feel like I don't go to Starbies often, so this kind of feels like a first impression. Oh, it's like milk. This is like straight up milk. What? Is it a latte? I don't know, Jack. It's a oh whatever. Hmm. Iced hazelnut oat milk shake and espresso. Just tastes like milk to me for some reason. Hmm. Oh well, I got some milk. Brookers is making fun of me because I have to touch everything. <laughs> Brookers is just looking with her eyes. What? I have to touch everything. Hello, Brookers. Hello. What are you doing? Isn't that crazy? <laughs> Sorry, skinny problems. <laughs> My favorite kind of problem. Oh, this is kind of cute, Brookers. I found all of the neutral tank tops. I'm obsessed with all the browns. Look, literal birdie gray bridesmaid dress. Look, literal bridesmaid's dresses with the tag still on. That's cute. Okay, this probably looks weird because I have my leggings on and this is not how I would style it, but how cute. It's this little like silky floral skirt. It's cute. Okay, again, looks weird because I have the leggings, but I saw these shorts and I was just thinking they'd be perfect for tomorrow, which is 4th of July. Okay, tank number one, I think it's just a little too tight and a little bit see-through. Okay, tank number two, kind of the same. Kind of see the... Mm -hmm. Okay, I don't know if it's just my bra, but... I don't think it's a tank top kind of day for me. took Zoe's diaper off. I want to show our new routine. I have to cut the PP pads in half because I go through them so quickly now. Eventually I could probably cut this in half too, but sometimes it still gets a little messy. Come here, baby. Ben. Ben. Aquí, so. I just ordered a new pack of doggy diapers because um, we needed more. I will leave the Amazon link to these in the description box or the comments or something like that, but um these we've already had like this brand before so this was just like a refill elbow good girl let me see let me go good girl wow what a good girl Zozy. but i'm really proud today she didn't have an accident on her bed which i'm so relieved for definitely a little victory for us today now we're gonna put her diaper on so how you put on hey doggy diaper you gotta start with the tail, so there's always gonna be a little hole for their tail. Just feed it all the way through. So flatten the back portion, and then I take the like peck peck part, take that, make sure you like cup her peck peck so you make sure you're covering it. Take the Velcro, attach it, and then this one, I just put my hand under to reach it. Okay, make sure that feels good. And then just check here that her entire little 
peck peck is covered. Okay, she's good to go. You can go to bed, Mama. No, no, this way. Go to bed. One little trick, though, I do have with doggy diapers, especially the way these fit, because they're just ever so slightly big, but I don't want to go down a size because I think they'll be too small for her. But I have the edges kind of peaked up. That way you just have a more secure fit around here. Okay, she's good. I got some more packages here. So the diapers were one of them. Um, I did get a bridesmaid's dress today for Brickers to try on. So we tried that on. I don't know if I should show you guys. You guys let me know, should the bridesmaids dresses, should those be a surprise until the wedding or can I show you guys those now? I don't know the rules. You let me know what's appropriate, like an appropriate amount to share. But she tried that on today. She looks so beautiful. And then I got two other packages. Yes, oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this. Ta-da! So I ordered the viral wireless go to road mics or mic, I should say it's just one. So one is the mic and the other one is the reader, I think that you attach to like your camera or your phone. So I actually plan on using these for my main channel videos. I don't think I'll use them in the vlogs because the vlogs are just more casual anyways. But for my main channel videos, I'm going to use these and then who knows, maybe some TikToks, like maybe some videos I film on my phone, we'll see. But I'm very excited for that. I got a PR package from Pixie. Let's see what they sent. Their packaging is always just so sweet and pretty. Oh, what is this? Super Glow, I love these like on the go products. Okay. I think it's a highlighter, Petal Dew. Oh, this one is so my cup of tea. What did that say? Gilded Gold, this one. I can already tell, this is gonna be my color. That's so cool, so now I have, wait, I can actually show you. In my little makeup vanity section, I have blush, bronzer, and now highlighter. I'm gonna give this light one to my sister. I think she'll like that. But this gold, I already know. This is gonna be my color. I can already tell. Let's see. Oh, I just kind of ruined it a little bit there. Okay, cannot see in this lighting, but it's okay. I can see. It's like yellowy. Look, the whole family, the whole little trio. I love it. Oh my gosh, wait. I feel a sneeze coming up. <laughs> Bless me. Okay, thank you. Okay, let me show you what I picked up from the thrift store today. So starting with these baskets. Oh my gosh, I'm a sucker for baskets. And they had so many. Like if Burgers didn't stop me, I probably would have grabbed some more. First I saw this cute little guy. It's so cute. Isn't this the cutest little basket? And it's like really shallow. And so I was thinking my baked, like baked goods, like cookies, like small things, cookies or muffins. I can put it here whenever I bring a batch to Nana's house or my parents or whatever. I can bring them in this. And then I saw this big one, which it's deeper, but still shallow at the same time. This would be perfect for bread. So I can fill this up with bread and bring these baskets over with baked goods. I'm excited. So I'm gonna wash those and put them outside to dry in the sun tomorrow because they're just kind of dusty. And then for clothing, I did pick up the skirt. I don't really know how to style it though. Um, I think maybe like a white top and some like white sneakers could be like a cute little look here or I can dress it up. Um, yeah, I'm not 100% sure how I will style this yet. So if you have any recommendations for this like long silky skirt, let me know. 
And then I did get the shorts. They are, they are big. But they have the tag still on it. It's from Target. The Universal Threads line, which I actually love Universal Threads. And I have a lot of my thrifted stuff is Universal Threads because I just naturally gravitate towards that brand at Target. It's just really good quality for Target. Um, but yes, these shorts i think they're so cute these are gonna be great like beach shorts summer shorts so i'm so gonna wear these tomorrow so i'm gonna wash these right now oh i forgot to share this skirt um is from the brand forgotten grace never heard of that before but forgotten grace and then like i mentioned target universal threads tag still on and then this one also still has the tag still on i did end up getting this cute cardigan Bookers thought it was gross looking. <laughs> we have very different styles. So like that doesn't bother me if she says it looks gross. But this still had the original tags on it. It's from the brand Cider. Ew, I just noticed it's 100% acrylic. Gross. But I've actually been seeing Cider all over social media and like all over TikTok. They've got some cute things. But this I just thought was so sweet. I love the wide bell sleeves and the colors and it's like kind of cropped. I think this is gonna look really cute. So I am gonna do a load of laundry, throw those in there. But that is pretty much it for today's vlog. Thank you guys for hanging out with me today. Um, I hope you enjoyed. Today is the day before 4th of July. And I don't know if your guys' area does this, but they do fireworks today and tomorrow. It's so weird. So. We had the TV blasted just now because the fireworks were going off for the last 30 minutes and, you know, Zoe is not good with fireworks, so we had to blast the TV and then we're going to do the same thing again tomorrow. I kind of low-key hate that they're doing fireworks two days in a row now. It just, it's so excessive and I'm not a fireworks girl. I just think of, like, how terrifying it is for all of the animals, so, like, I'm anti-fireworks. Um... I mean, they're, they're beautiful to look at if I'm ever driving by Disneyland and the fireworks go off or whatever. Like, they're cool, but, like, when you think about the impact of fireworks, like, ugh. Yeah, I am, I'm not a fireworks girl. Baby, and now